In order to cover multiple applications, we offer two DICE configurations. The DICE DS model for suction lift applications and the DICE DM model for flooded suction applications. The DICE addresses the prevailing leak problems on chemical dosing systems by having no glued or threaded connections on the pressurized side. By integrating several components into a single module, it makes it easier to design, fabricate, install, and maintain a dosing system. As shown, the DICE vertical fluid path allows gas to easily escape, avoiding problems related to trap gas in the dosing systems. It also features a minimal pressurized volume, which makes it extremely fast for the pump to pressurize or repressurize the system. The patent pending technology of DICE is a simple compact all-in-one solution to integrate all the necessary components of a chemical dosing system inside a single module. The DICE modules are installed at the dosing pump discharge and feature the following components. A back pressure valve to maintain a constant pressure on the dosing pump discharge. A pressure relief valve to limit the system from overpressurizing. A pressure indicator with an isolator to set the back pressure valve pressure relief valve as well as validating proper pump operation, three ball valves allowing for a pump calibration, and to isolate and release the pressure inside the module. The DICE DS and DM modules are equipped with three ports on the side that can be used for secondary pumps or additional accessories such as a pulsation dampener, pressure transmitter, etc. In normal operation, the dosing pump will be pumping chemicals from the chemical tank inside the DICE inlet, then passing through the back pressure valve and into the injection line, feeding the process. The pressure indicator will be measuring the back pressure valve set point, in this case, 70 psi. When a clear acrylic module is used, fluid flow through the module can be seen by looking through the transparent material. This makes it extremely easy to troubleshoot the system. In the case of a blocked pipe, a blocked injection quill, or simply a closed isolation valve, the pressure relief valve will open and cycle back the excess fluid into the chemical tank, or directly to the pump suction depending on the configuration. This will prevent the system from overpressurizing. The pressure indicator will be measuring the pressure relief valve set point, in this case 100 psi. For more technical information, visit our website.